Tuan Dr. Mahathir Mohamad dengan diiringi oleh uh, yang berbahagia Tuan Dr. Siti Asma uh, di Denver tiba um, di New York pada hari esok 24 September dan akan berada di sini sehingga 28 uh, September ada dua orang menteri yang akan uh, menerima yang amat berhormat dalam menteri iaitu yang Muhammad Dato' Sri Muhammad Azmin Ali Menteri Halewan Ekonomi uh, saya sendiri dan uh, pegawai kanan uh, khususnya daripada Usma Putra dan juga daripada uh, Kementerian uh, Pembangunan Ekonomi Prime Minister Tun Dr. Mahathir Mohamad, who will attend the United Nations General Assembly, UNGA, is expected to use the platform to further Malaysia's aspiration on the international stage. Relating this to the Malaysian press, Foreign Minister Datuk Saifuddin Abdullah said the main agenda of the visit will be Dr. Mahathir's speech at the 74th UNGA on September 27, September 28, 3 a.m. Malaysian time. Saifuddin says he believes Tun Dr. Mahathir will repeat Malaysia's call for urgent UN reforms and stressed that while these reforms are being done, it is important for member states to respect international institutions and rules. Saifuddin added Malaysia support multilateralism while countries are allied in pursuing common goals but the concept is increasingly coming under threat. Dr. Mahathir, at the recent launch of the foreign policy framework of the new Malaysia, said there are powerful countries that are disregarding multilateral agreements and imposing their will for their own agendas. Example includes the injustice in Palestine, recent tension in Kashmir, and unilateral trade or economic sanctions. The framework itself, guided by Dr. Mahathir's speech at the UN last year, his first as Malaysia's seventh prime minister, envisions the country's being more proactive in its foreign policy. This week's UN meeting would be an early test of this new approach. Saifuddin says the Prime Minister will also speak on the topic Rule of Law Through Multilateralism at Columbia University's World Leaders Forum on Wednesday.